I'm dead. I'm literally <laughs> dead. I have died. The lunch lady killed me. I'm a freaking dead man. All right, let's try the swimming hall. Like give me a little, yeah, normal, I guess is the easiest. <laughs> All right, let's try this. All right, lunch lady, you and me, we're going to dance. We're going to tussle. Tussle, tussle. <laughs> you look pretty strong if you were taller, you know. Maybe I'm not doing that. <laughs> So now I'm in a pool hall of some kind of pool. Okay. Everybody's burping today. I'm Kelly, assuming noise is probably a mechanic a for the that first I should be worried time. about. I'm not going to do anything about it, in. but I am going to be worried about it. Cafeteria key. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anyway. I feel good today, so I'm gonna go in and watch it. I was kind of tired last week. So, I didn't want to watch it all, because I didn't, wasn't in the best mood. Who deserves me in a good mood? I saw on Tumblr. <laughs> um. On Tumblr, I saw... Some I saw Stan the Waterman. I saw um, Wolf Stash. I didn't see those people in my round. I didn't know there was that many more options I was missing. So we have to go find them. We gotta go find that, those routes. And then I gotta. I haven't seen anybody gift the, this one, Come, the part where the door moves. Oh! <laughs> oh my, why isn't that a gift yet? I'm going to have to ask the, some of the, the good Tumblr things. Oh my god. <laughs> you so Look how She was taking requests though. We gotta ask her. Well, you're a baby, I guess now. Thank you. Like a tank, too. 
It's so much better on a laptop. Tank two. Explosives. Oh my Speed god. The main reactor. Turns out you pretty much need the power of a star to tear open a wormhole. So a star I built. Built like a tank too. <laughs> yep. Yeah, it's Bert. He makes sure that the ship don't go boom. Next up is Cryo. Colin. <laughs> Colonists are prepped, stable, and ready for transit. Systems are working at 110% too, which is a little weird, but overkill never hurts. Trust me. You do not want to be awake when the warp core hits the gas. CC. Has -hat. Captain, all colonists are prepped and stable. 100,000 souls ready for a new life. Let's get them there safe. Oh, don't worry. Before they know it, they're going to wake up to the sight of a brand new planet with a fresh cup of coffee in their hands. Why don't you give them more windows to look through? Well, maybe I will. Maybe then someone might appreciate the aesthetics. Besides, <laughs> what could go wrong with a crew like this? Easy, good, you go. Don't worry, Cap. No asteroids <laughs> get by me. You can count on that. <laughs> Should I just rewatch everything? I guess I was just gonna go through. I'm gonna watch it again. I guess. Seems fine. Everything is accounted for. We're ready to see our new home. It's all that's left now. I know how your speeches can get people riled up. I love you, everyone. Good job. engaged. <laughs> <laughs> Retarded, so I gotta go back. This seems a lot. Sometimes I'll hear things, understand things. <laughs> my first playthrough we just get sucked out the window and that that's the end my life goes on without it I don't like that
Wake the cow from the sleepy head. I still don't know what the hell is happening, but we seem to have this situation all under control. Yeah. Impact detected. Computer, activate the asteroid defense system! Analyzing. No. What do you mean, no? <laughs> Computer, what's wrong with the ADS? Yes. Offline. Why? Offline. Computer, what is wrong? Offline. Computer, what's wrong with the ADS? You. Click this mouse for the first time. Maybe I did, though. I don't know. Oh no, I, I probably did it. <laughs> Wait a moment, I don't know. Absolutely. 
catastrophic. <laughs> I like how he's always like a baby thing. I've had this a long time. This is a little baby thing. Like the ship seems to be doing okay. Coolant leak in cryo. Maintenance. Shutting down. Why? Whatever. Coolant leaking into the cryo. It's negative 200 degrees in there. We gotta fix it faster. We're gonna start losing colonists. Yeah, we're we'll hanging the crystals around. What should the we do? Looks like the ice crystals. Collaborative yeah. unit of cooperation. A dynamic duo. <laughs> That's weird, isn't that weird? Uh huh. <laughs> uh, thanks for the outside again. We'll just do all of those. That was. <laughs> <We're almost> there. <laughs> this is so scary. 
this whole time? <laughs> Going outside. You're not going to the airlock, are you? Okay, great. Sorry, Captain. For some reason, and I know it's crazy, I had this bizarre feeling like you were going to throw yourself out of the ship's airlock. <laughs> like I could see it in my mind's eye. Captain, no! <laughs> I knew it. I knew you were going to throw yourself out of the airlock. How did I know that? Captain, wait. What do you think this is going to achieve? <laughs> Fun to feel that. Mm -hmm. Good morning, Captain. Coffee I feel weightless. Current ship status is nominal. Uh, oh, morning, mm. Captain. I just sleep. Good. Mm. Oh, man. Are we early? I didn't expect. No. I'm flattered. <laughs> Could you let go no. of my hand? No, no, no. Okay. Ready. No, no, no. My first playthrough of Heist, I wouldn't let go of his hand. Okay? The whole time I was like, oh. I followed him the whole way. I wouldn't let He kept yelling at me and stopped following me. But I did it. Oh, where are you did you sleep well? <laughs> Sorry, Captain. Not a single asteroid tried to hit us this whole journey. I love it. Some pretty good luck. Did you sleep? <laughs> <laughs> oh, morning, Captain. Morning. Did you sleep well? <laughs> I said. Morning, Captain. Not a single asteroid tried to hit us this whole journey. Pretty good luck. <laughs> You're a boring pansy. Don't worry, Captain. I'll find something to shoot. Too late. Captain, I'm late. I'm so healthy and accounted for. I might even owe Mark an apology. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Fishermen know that the sea is dangerous, <laughs> that the storm terrible. They've never found these dangers sufficient reason to remain ashore. <laughs> Captain, you seem a little stressed. I know that cry sleep can affect everyone differently, but coffee always helps. It's way you better. It. You got us here safely. I was funny the first time. It was funny the second time. I know bad news when I see it. And that is bad news. We gotta get back to the bridge right now. Oh, I wonder if this is what happened to the first invincible. But they didn't have plans. Oh, I wonder if this is what happened to the first invincible. But they didn't have plans. Oh, I wonder if
to get back to the bridge right now. Oh, uh, wonder if this is what happened to the first invincible. But they didn't have plans. Oh, wait, Cat. You're moving around. You're so cute. Captain, Mark got our ass and stuck in a wormhole. No, I did. No, maybe I did. My God. Mark got us stuck in a goddamn wormhole. Pulse press is redlining across all decks. <laughs> How did Mark even He's cause so this one cool. to damage? Mark got us stuck in a goddamn wormhole. <laughs> Pulse press is redlining across all decks. How did Mark even cause this one to damage? What the fuck? Horizon protocol activation successful. Ship is free from the effects of the wormhole Aww. that was caused Aww. by Mark. So cute. You knew it. You knew something was wrong. Boy, were you glad to prove it. With the Event Horizon protocol <laughs> initiated, the ship was finally free from the devastating effects of the wormhole. Although left to drift among the stars, luckily, you just so happen to end up in a system with a beautiful planet suitable for habitation. Humanity's first colony among the stars would be a smashing success. The colonists celebrated this momentous occasion and eagerly awaited setting foot on this wonderful new planet. But you kept the colonists aboard the ship for a while. You needed time to check the planet for it, after all. When they asked you what it was, you simply responded that it was whatever they wanted to happen as soon as you let your guard down. Your crew didn't feel the need to question you further, and were more than happy to wait a few years aboard the ship while you finished scouring every corner of the planet for it. But once your checks were complete, the colony positively thrived. After, you built an extensive network of defense systems and surveillance systems, of course. You knew that it was still out there just waiting for the right moment to strike. And with those systems in place, your people enjoyed the bounties of a practically idyllic planet. They also enjoyed the bounty of bi-daily random security screens. Wouldn't want it to show up in the middle of a supervised safety meal, now would we? But your people were happy when you allowed them to be. After all, <laughs> happiness could lead to complacency, which could be disastrous when it eventually struck. But that was never going to happen. Not under your watchful eye. The colony would be safe from them for many, many years. You made sure of it. Yeah, we got that one before. I like this, this animation. Software update complete. Good morning, Captain. We are currently error years into our journey. Coffee is en route. Current ship status is absolutely catastrophic. Oh, 
temperature stabilizing. Oh yeah, you can't check the <laughs> Oh, just <laughs> pauses it. I keep wanting to do the cannonball. All the time hey, now. To myself. Oh, 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 Now we had a good opportunity there. I mean, we've seen all this before. Well, we had a we could be a real showman. Maybe a blue. through that door and then ending up in the center of a star and then slowly feeling the flesh melt <laughs> from my bones no, no. but i'm alive and you're alive and i remember and you remember right mm -hmm. this is incredible <laughs> computer activate the emergency repair protocol oopsie boopsie protocol engaged full system reset in force <laughs> System rebooted. Reviving crew. Backup systems engaged. Okay. Uh, computer, can you shut down the warp core? Negative. Warp core cannot be reached. Okay, so the wormhole's still a problem. And my emergency repair protocol can't shut it down from here. We need to get in the warp core somehow. But that shouldn't be a problem for two immortal gods like us. The way I see it, all we need to do is keep jumping in. And eventually, we'll find the right door, we'll get to the warp core, shut it down, save the colonists, and you and me can enjoy our newfound powers until they slowly drive us mad and turn us away from everything we know and love. <laughs> so what do you say? Come on, let's jump in again. 
<laughs> What's the worst that could happen? We could die again, I guess. I wasn't. I wasn't so bad. I wasn't so bad. Now I could see the screen. We had to jump. I love the jumping. Hell yeah! We'll be at that warp core before you know it. I think we were pretty close last time, too. So, this time, I'll dash right, you dash right. <laughs> I don't know, is this allowed? I saw somebody else doing it, live streaming. Ah, okay. Nobody watches me anyway. I'm not quite what They're I expected. just my love. But now we know so what not to do. Be with you. So, what do you say? Let's jump in again. Jump We almost had it last time. Makes me feel Hell messy. yeah. Shouldn't be long now before we're resting on the shores of our new home planet. We'll be heroes. First they'll give you a medal. Then they'll give me a medal. Then they'll give you a medal. Then they'll give me a medal. Then they'll give you a medal. They might give her a medal. Then they'll give you <laughs> <me. laughs> They do say that failure is the best teacher, so shall we go again? Come on, buddy. Friend, pal, friend, I mean, friend. Captain. <laughs> Captain. <gasps> Hell yeah. I think we almost had it last time. It was pretty close there. I mean, you kind of screwed up, but I was doing it. <laughs> so I'm going to fix what I did wrong. You just do something completely different so that it's better. And we'll get there in no time and save all our people before they can say. <laughs> <laughs> Plane, but uh, I can't help but feel like you could have tried a little harder. Like, uh, I get that I'm the one to pull the most weight around here, but we could help each other out, you know? But it's okay. Why don't we try it again? We'll jump back in, and this time we'll work together. together. We'll work together, together like a team, like friends do. Oh, I love it. What do you say? Yeah. Hell yeah! We'll be at that warp core before you know it. I think we were pretty close last time, too. So, this time, I'll dash right, you dash right. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> I'm not quite what I expected. Okay, now, now it's looping. So, right? We saw that first. Say? Let's jump in again. We almost had it last time. We'll definitely get it this time. Probably. That's why we did this last Probably. time. I wonder if I'm going to find them. <laughs> that one's done. We'll work together. <sighs> yeah, you're probably right. They deserve to know what's happening. And they might have some ideas how to solve this. Probably not good ones, so. <laughs> Captain, thank you for such an upfront and thorough explanation of the situation. The mark of a great leader, always being open and honest with the crew, never holding anything back. Sweetest things turn sour <laughs> by their deeds. <laughs> a lily that festers smells far worse than weeds. What? <laughs> the bottom line is, we need to get to the warp core and shut it down. It's having effects that I never could have predicted. The captain and I, we've tried some things, but we need fresh ideas. Yeah. Have you tried blowing it up? Obviously, they've tried blowing it up. Look who you're working with. Uh, no, we haven't. But that is a good idea. And no, it's to... not. You know nothing about wormholes. You can actually cause a false vacuum collapse. Well, no, we wouldn't. And also, that's impossible. I what think. if we back the ship up into the wormhole? What if we pop her in reverse and just undo all the wormhole stuff? <laughs> okay, Mark, I owe you an apology that because obviously you're not the stupidest person on this ship. Thank you. Hey, Captain. You never do my stuff. <laughs> Clearly, we need to send out a distress signal because someone sabotaged this ship. You know, now that she mentions it, some of the damage on the ship did seem intentional. 
I think someone needs to go over every inch of this ship and do some rap. No, 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 no one sabotages the ship because the only two people that can change anything on the ship are me and the captain. And the only person that I trust more than myself is the captain. And two, how could anybody find us if we don't know where we are? That's my point exactly. We don't know where we are, we don't know how we got here, and we have the lives of the colonists at stake. Or, hear me out. <laughs> no, no, it's not up to you. It's not up to you. I'm sorry, it's not up to you. It's up to the captain. They haven't let us down yet. That's true. It's so all defer to your wisdom. What do you say, Captain? Well, we did the reverse the last time. How we? But I think we. I don't know. I don't know where the they're Thank hitting. You, captain, this is the right move. Well, Come on, guys, let's get this like ship it. secured. Understood, Cap. But if you need some, just let me know. That's why I don't talk. No! I chose you first. I like that well, idea more. A it's a great move. Best move, actually. Makes sense. Well, you send the distress signal and see how good a move it is. <laughs> it's going to help. Broadcasting signal. All right, that should do it. I guess I should look into some of the problems we've been having, though. I hate to admit it, but Celsi might be onto something. Nobody should have been able to reprogram those drones. Alert. Unknown vessel approaching. What? Is it human? No. What is it? Warning. Unknown vessel is locking onto the ship. Energy begins spiking. Computer evasive maneuvers! Unable to comply. We are still stuck in the wormhole. Oh. Right. Unknown vessel is activating some kind of... Uh, Captain, what just happened? <laughs> Did we die again? Oh. Hi. Um, hello. Uh, oh, hi. Oh, okay. Alien? Uh, hello. <laughs> I am Mark. And as a representative of humanity, I would love well uh, us. Uh, 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 I, we come in peace. And we are here to share our mutual respect, admiration, our, our culture. <laughs> Human! Human! You! Die! You! Much! Danger! Mm -hmm. I! You! Eat! No, 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 no! Mm -hmm. Oh, my God, you're so cute. Well, we didn't choose attack. Cause how could you? What? What happened? You broke peace. You broke peace. Well, that's a wound that just won't heal. 
The kind of wounds that lead you down to the <laughs> The captain looked right through me with those baby gray eyes. <laughs> the kind of look that could kill. And the kind of looks that could kill to match. Maybe someday I'll work up the courage to ask them out on that date. What? Yeah, right. Maybe someday I'll destroy the universe. Oh, so, <laughs> got any other Please ideas to get us out of this mess? Please, God. You're just happy to see me. Oh, I'm very happy. Ah! <laughs> oh my God, it's so beautiful. Oh my God, you know everybody's saying that. They're thinking the same thing. Hello. How could you do that? <laughs> yes, go please. Please. Oh! oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Where's the engine to stop it? Who cares about it? Well, I care. Where is <laughs> oh, I love it. Wait, there's the sound. to get us out of this mess or uh, just happy to see me uh, yeah. we did that I guess I don't know I think we did both Sounds of these good, Captain. you always know the right move to make it was a terrible idea the worst I've heard yet Shara the captain was pretty but they were clearly an idiot all face and no brains and no ways out of here cursed damn thumbs up Signals out, Captain. All that's left to do now is wait until something's coming, boss. It's terrible. It's horrible. Get yourself together and tell us what it is. Detecting an energy buildup from an unknown vessel. It's some kind of alien spaceship. Oh my god! 
Something in Rogue's blood yearned for the primal satisfaction <laughs> of savage destruction. Just like Wog's yeah. ancestors. Wog like helping, but Wog also like hurting. <laughs> between order and chaos. Not the wrong gals. I was fine, see? I didn't have nothing to do with that wormhole, see? Come on, you can't send me back there. You can't make me sing. I'll never sing. I want a lawyer. I have rights. Now there's something you don't see every day. Eyes like fresh gray grass. Hair like the first gray rays of sunshine. And a hand glowing with the gray light of an unstable warp crystal. Oh, yeah. My gut was telling me that they were something special. More special than that ugly one. That one makes my gut turn just looking at them. And my gut's never steered me wrong before. <laughs> If it isn't well, well. the humans, <laughs> so lost, so human. He's very green. That's a lot of talk for someone outnumbered two to one. Who am I? I'd like to introduce you to my associate, Wug. Wug, how could you do this to us? After all we've been through. We never met. <laughs> You sure? You look just like this guy. Guy! You think what? Guy what? You think all what? Look the same? I think you look like asshole! <laughs> if you're done insulting my associate, <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to drop your weapons and come with me. Not gonna happen. We haven't come all this way to give up now. Don't be stupid. That's why you have to drop your weapons so we can help. We're the only ones who can. So you better surrender. Not gonna happen. <laughs> Did we throw throw that on I think we chose both of these. I wonder if I'm gonna find it. Well if I guess I have to eventually. All your weapons. You too, Captain. Perfect. Now follow me.
I just have one question for you two. How did you make the woman? Hey, whoa, easily. There's no need to be so. <laughs> question for you two. How did you make the woman? Hey, she had. I like her ears. I mean, I could see them, but I wasn't really processing them. I like how she's cute little elfy ears. 